So, um, since we just did that uh, lecture, let's try to, that lecture topic, let's try to classify these as um, homoatomic or heteroatomic. So, I guess the question says, classify the following molecules as homoatomic or heteroatomic. So, what do you got here? You've got oxygen, which is O2. So, they're giving you the molecular formula here. O2 carbon dioxide, which is CO2, and carbon monoxide, which is CO. So later you're going to learn how to draw these um, molecules and understand why they're built the way they are. Um, but um, for right now, we just want to know whether um, all of the atoms in the molecule are the same, which, mean, which is homoatomic, or if some atoms in the molecule are different than other atoms in the molecule, of course. So, um, if we look at O2 here, right, we know that there's, well, this subscript means that there's two oxygens stuck together, so they're bonded together. So, there's just two oxygens, so that's a homoatomic molecule. Um, so, CO2, right, remember when it's the whole formula here. It means that they're, all these atoms are bonded together. So, of course, that means that there's one carbon atom and two oxygen atoms bonded together to make up the molecule carbon dioxide, or CO2. So, that means that there's different types of atoms um, that are necessary to construct carbon dioxide. So, we call that a heteroatomic molecule. And then carbon monoxide, another common molecule, actually a very interesting structure when we get to that. But um, you can see here it's composed of one carbon atom and one oxygen atom. So, um, of course, that's not both the same atom, so that's also heteroatomic. So, um, are there any questions on this one? So, pretty straightforward, I guess. Um, we'll do one more problem on this, and if there are any questions, then you guys can ask them then, okay? So, we cool with that one? Like I said, I think pretty straightforward.